Okay, already. Oh my god! Okay. I am torturing myself once again, playing more of these haunted PS1 games. This is one of the ones we played, Dread Delusion. Wasn't too bad, honestly. And the other one was Sauna 2000, which was a little worse, not gonna lie. And I kind of want to go in here, play a game that doesn't seem that scary, which would be, yeah, Tasty Ramen. But you know what? I'm going to grow some balls here, okay? And we're going to play something that looks a bit worse. Okay, you have a gun in this one, so we're definitely going to play this. This is Filth Breed, and I'm not even going to question it. Homeless shelters all across the state have reported disappearances of several people. Investigators are pointing to Louis Burton as a prime suspect. I do not know that guy, so I can't have any input on that, but I mean... Apparently, he has a track record of smuggling cocaine across the border. According to his testimony, Burns been recruited by a local cult and held captive in an unknown location. Oh, God. A transport truck matching that of the suspect has been located next to a warehouse in the outskirts of Detroit. Okay, so we're in Detroit. We've been tasked to search the area for any evidence pertaining to the case. Okay, um, I'm guessing I don't have any option of backing out because, uh, not gonna lie, I kind of do want to oh yeah we can't exit you turn back straight away and tell your superior you found nothing my quick return raised some eyebrows but nobody was buying that cult nonsense anyways okay the trail goes cold and the case is eventually archived okay wow um thanks game that thank you all right so let's not be a pussy this time okay we have a job to do and we're gonna investigate this place okay we're going to figure out what happened to him. And, um... Yeah, I'm not liking this right off the bat. We have a... That's some sort of deer or a buck skull. Looks like a place to sleep. Okay, we already found a gun. This seems to be an amazing establishment. We already found a gun. Scroll up. Okay, yeah, I read that. Okay, already. Oh my god! Okay, dude, why did I- That was so dumb. I heard him. For some reason, I looked to the left. I don't know why I looked to the left. There's a fucking wall here. There's no reason for me to look to the left. Okay, alrighty. Oh my god! Okay. It looks like some sort of- Robot? Of some sort? Okay. I tried to hit control, but I, I guess control- shoots too so i mean that's okay we just wasted a bullet not too bad the good thing is i did hear him from quite a ways away so i'm hoping it's like that for all the guys that are inevitably lurking here is that ammo oh you know what? i'm pretty sure you have to unequip yeah okay it did tell me that in the tutorial that's the problem you can't have your gun equipped to actually interact with anything so we're gonna have to be very on edge okay and Let's be real here. I am already on edge. I hear something. The gun is coming out. Okay. Okay, I hear that. Headshot, maybe? Headshot? He took a lot longer to die than the other one. I don't know what that is. It's some sort of heat? Okay, we can't open the door, but you know what? Let's leave it anyways. What, what what good are we gonna get out of that? There's something flying around. I'm guessing these are cockroaches. Oh god, I hear something in there. Does not sound like a pleasant noise. Oh my god, that's a face. Uh, Maybe we go this way? Possibly? Oh my god, I really hate this. This... This is 10 times worse than all the other games we, we've played. Oh, yeah, you have to take... I'm so dumb. Okay, that's probably really frustrating. I keep forgetting, all right? But now I know you have to put the gun in the holster to interact with things. Oh, God. I don't think I have to go that way, but... I feel like I'm doing a disservice not going in that room. Okay, we can't anyways, so... Oh, my God, that was just a noise. Okay, I see you. And hear you. Sounds like there's two. Uh, how to reload? How do you reload? Okay, automatic reloading. I do not like these things. Yeah, why did I even go? There's no reason to go over there. Something was gonna happen. But we have made it. 
to the second floor. I feel better on a higher level. Seems we have some sort of book. Um, looks like some sort of sacred book. What language is that? I could not tell you. And you know what? I'm kind of happy because there's probably some creepy shit in that book. Let's be real. Oh, wait, we have a light. Oh my god. Is that the sun? Maybe? Which innards reveal the path? Bring forth the lice mother. Um, I do not want to know what the lice mother is. And I hope we don't meet her. But... I don't know. I have a feeling we're gonna... Maybe not. Maybe it's just some rambling. I like the light. Like I said, the second floor is way better. Already. Okay, that room doesn't look nice. Okay, I'm not walking past that. Screw that. Okay, we probably have to. Was that... Looks like he has a maggot-infested crotch going on. Not gonna judge. I'm just gonna walk by. Okay. We're gonna jump down. Uh, this is gross. Oh my god. Cockroaches. You know what? After all the shit we've been through, I don't mind these cockroaches. I mean, it's a little weird, a little creepy, how they're hanging off the walls and all that. Yeah, there's definitely something down here with us. Oh, God. Now, somebody just burped. They definitely do not have any manners here. We shouldn't worry about that right now. Let's get out of here. Okay. Okay. Thank you, game. This game is definitely not uh, generous, okay? Good thing I do have lightning fast reflexes. Oh, wait, so this is where we came from. Okay, I see. Yeah, that's where we came from. Does that mean we can leave? Right? I mean, surely we have enough evidence, you know? I think we can leave, right? We got pest control. Ending three. Oh, wait, there's more endings. Okay. Uh. So, I'm... I'm not going to play any of the other ones, okay? We're, we're Let's just move on. Okay, so after a stressful experience like that, I feel like the only way I can recover is by playing Tasty Ramen. Oh, hey, welcome to the special gameplay demo version of Tasty Ramen. Okay, they're greeting me. This is nice. I feel so much better in, in this game. The atmosphere is completely flipped. Okay, I'm going to skip through this so you guys don't, you know, have to sit here while I'm reading the tutorial. So I'll see you in two seconds. All right, so I know what to do now. Apparently, I can throw things to make distracting noises, which kind of scares me, not going to lie. I don't know what I'm distracting, but we do have a key. Oh, wait. Okay, that makes sense. I hear squeaking. Um, he doesn't look, he doesn't look too mean. But just my, you know, horror game mind is telling me to avoid it, but... I don't know, it's not really coming after me. Okay, so I can pick this up. Alright, I did exactly what it told me to do. I don't know why. Okay. Oh god, okay. I should have... It's definitely chasing me, okay? We can confirm that. This is something we need to avoid. Um, throw that out over there. Throw that... Okay, nope. He's coming this way. I need... Oh yeah, there we go. Key. Nope, not the stool. The key. That just made noise. Okay. We're good. I think I just... He probably... I think he just ate it. Okay. Um. So, okay, I see. Tasty ramen. He wants to eat the ramen. Seems we're in a ramen shop. So everything is ramen. Um. I do like ramen. Maybe not as much as this guy, but... Take that. Okay. We need to look for the keys. Okay. He has spotted me. I hear him right behind me. It's squeaking, but it's not... Okay. Ooh. The squeaking noise is not that scary, but it's just... When it's chasing after you, man. I do not like it at all. Okay. I think we're good, though. Nope. We're not good. Why do I keep dropping the key? Okay. Okay. He is a, he's a mean little guy. Okay. He may look cute, but we do have to avoid him. Okay. Here we go. Got the key. I don't have any way to crouch. Oh, wait. Okay, that, that helps. We now have three keys left. Um, okay. Oh god. 
That was close. We gotta juke him out. Okay. I think I got the general idea of what we have to do. Okay. Which is avoid him. Oh god, I hate the squeaking, man. I hate the squeaking right behind me. Just so we can distract him. Oh my god, dude. I'm taking all the wrong- oh, okay, I'm taking all the wrong turns. I cannot believe I just got scared right then. That's very embarrassing. I should probably cut that out of the video. Dude, I'm telling you. Oh god. He just ate the ramen. I think I have a good way of avoiding him, though, okay? We just need to try and hear where he's stepping. Okay, there he is. Okay, where's the key? Where's the key? Here we go. Pretty sure we have two more after this one. Oh, God. Okay, okay. Oh, my God. Did you see his face? He does not look as cute as he did in the beginning. Okay, I'm surprising myself right here with my juking abilities. But we cannot stop like that to grab the key because that will end in our death. I do want to do this without dying once. That would be very nice. Okay, because I'm guessing you're going to have to start it over. Okay, there's one key here. Can I jump? No, I can't. Okay. Seems the way is clear right now. Here we go. One key left. Dude, the pressure is on. Oh, God. He's walking by. I wish I could peek, man. Imagine this game had a peeking mechanic. That would be nice. Okay. So I do know where the key is. It's at that last shelf over there. But I do want to be smart about this. Okay. So I'm going to go on the outskirts. Oh, you know what? Let's distract him. I've, like, never used that. Oh, God. Okay. So he is going to investigate. Okay. Okay. Why that? Okay. Um, that was me being dumb. I shouldn't have peeked out there. Grab the key. Nope. Okay. We're not good at doing that, man. I've tried that, like, five times this gameplay, and I've not done it once, so I need, I need to get better at picking up the key while running. Okay, here we go. So I'm going to throw this over this counter. No. Pick it up, please. Okay, thank you. I'm very happy you didn't see me just then. And I think... Did we do it? Hello. Haha, you did it. Very impressive. I know. Thank you. Okay, here's where you want to go if you want to check out the development progress of the game. And time for some credits. Okay, so... This is a game by Marcus Horn. He has a very interesting... Um, game so those were two more haunted ps1 games and i feel like in the next episode i'm gonna bite the bullet all right and we're gonna play these japanese themed horror games starting with this one and i'm not excited okay i've said it before but you know what maybe i'm just overhyping it i'll see you then have a good one later